Thank you for tapping into Gracefully Speaking. This is a collective reading. While you are here, go ahead and hit the like and the subscribe button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. We're going to go ahead and jump right into the messages that the angels have for you. Let's see. What we got. All right. Let's just song your love makes me weak like chuck i love when you wear heels yeah i was getting that um, foot fetish and white toes let's see what else we get here somebody swallowing their pride listen i'm ready to express my feelings towards you okay I, i'm really getting It's like somebody was trying to hold themselves back, but they can't. It's like somebody was trying to hold their feelings back from you, but they can't. It's something about your energy. This love is taken. But I'm feeling like instead of you taking energy, you were giving. And it's like this energy, this person cannot find elsewhere, okay? And it's like because of that, I'm getting this stuck like Chuck. I feel like they just spinning their wheels. And if they could have been initially trying to pull like power plays with you. Playing games. It says withdrawing attention. Or affection for no reason, ghosting, shaming, deliberate, deliberately delaying responses. But now this person that is opening up. I'm burning a heart chakra incense. This person is opening up. Yes, we're pathway. You see that opening? This person is is opening up. They're ready to experience you on another level. Okay. They're ready to do something they ain't never did. Okay? Tell me more about this stuff like Chuck. Tell me about this stuff. Shit. Damn, it's it. We're flying and everything. Alright, so we got a main male here. And then on the bottom of the deck, we have Pathway. It's like this person was trying to keep from expressing themselves. But it's like, it's a requirement. It's something that you require. Tell me more about stuff like shit. Give me one more about stuff like shit. All right. And then we have family room. We have one, two, one. For some of you guys, this person could have felt stuck in a relationship. They could have stuck. They could have felt stuck in some type of family situation. In a marriage, in some type of courtship that they were trying to release or get get out of. this stuck like chuck here give me, give me clarity on this stuck like chuck listen the sun and ace of cups And then we have the 
queen of swords at the bottom of the deck. So this person could have felt trapped in some type of home where they could have had responsibilities. It could have been a child in this home where they felt to need the need to keep the home together. But with this queen of swords here, this person could have been dealing with someone who was not nice. Very cutthroat. And there's sometimes there's a need to be in this energy. But when you are in your home, it's no need to be in the queen of swords. And I feel like this person was only in this energy. Like if they were with someone else, this is the only type of energy that they experienced. So to come through and experience you, they're realizing that they have to treat you differently than what they're accustomed to. Okay? The tower, something happened that uprooted this tree, that uprooted this person. And that was you. You uprooted this person from what they thought they wanted for the rest of their lives, okay? So if they were in some type of home situation where they could have been with someone else because of children or whatever, different ties and connections that they could have had with this person, when you came in, you shook the room. Listen, breaking again at the tower again. You brought the tower in their lives. That's why this person's saying I'm ready to express myself because they don't they don't want to risk losing you by not expressing themselves. By not telling you how they truly feel. They don't want to look back and regret not telling you how they felt. Clarify this. I love when you wear heels. Clarify I love when you wear heels. Clarify, I love when you wear heels. The number 10, what we got at the bottom of the deck, adjudication. This person wants to travel with you. They want y'all to go on some type of trip. If you guys are in the same city, they just want to get out, get out of the city. Tell me more about this journey, clarify journey. Clarify journey. With this four of cups here. Yeah, this person wants to get out of the city. They feel like by taking a trip, it will get you guys in a better space. A better head space. Because for some of you guys, you could truly be exactly what this shirt says. You could be over it. It's like, I want to, I need more. I want more. And this is the more that you're requiring, Ten of Cups. Okay? Tell me more about this journey. Some of you guys may not take this offer of going on this trip. Tell me more about this journey. Clarify journey, I guess. Clarify journey. It's like this person is curious about you too wondering what you're doing yeah listen this person knows that you could have any option you choose so for you to even be considering them at this time they know that they need to come in and express because if not you gotta move on You are the prize. Not to say that this person is not the prize, but you understand that you bring a table to the table. I'm seeing somebody like strutting in heels or like open toe heels. It's like when this person thinks about other people 
looking at you, considering you, trying to take you out, um, asking you for your number, it burns them up. It pisses them off. And this is another reason why they're coming in to speak their truth. Because it's like, if I don't tell you you're beautiful, somebody going to tell you. Tell me more about this journey. King of Cups with the Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. This person knows that they need to come in and offer you a cup. But what's in this cup? We have an Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of this deck. If whatever's in this cup does not equate to this, you're going to turn this person down. Because I was seeing value. You know your value. You, you know what you're worth. Those power plays and, you know, delayed text messages and leaving you on red and that shit ain't gonna work now 2023 it's not gonna work okay that's not going to work so this person gonna have to bring in something solid or you might as well just stay where you at but i feel like for a lot of you guys too the number 10 again we got 10 10 Yeah, the person is, is stressed. Because what do I give? What do I give to this person? What can I give to her? What can I give to him? To show him that I'm serious. I'm getting this time. To show him or her that I'm serious. What can I do? They're trying to figure it out. What can I do? Give me one more on this energy. What is this person going to do? What is this person going to do? We got a main male. I mean, a uh, main female with change. What is this person going to do? What is this person going to do? Are they going to come towards the collective? What is this person going to do? So we have a, a main male and then we have a main female out here. So you guys are coming out as a pair. All right, and then we got thought, and then we have privileged lady at the bottom of the deck. This person is thinking on what they what they want to do. They're thinking, contemplating on how to do this, how to how to come in, which way to go. Because they know they just got one time to make an impression. They only get this one chance. Clarify thoughts. Yeah, I'm going to close out the reading. Clarify thoughts. Let's get into these thoughts. Clarify thoughts. Listen. I told you this person to take you on a trip. Two of Wands. Look, Eight of Wands, communication. So definitely expect some communication from this person. What is this? Listen, they know that they need to come in with something solid. They know that it needs to be an equal exchange, one for one. Reciprocity. Receipt, giving and receiving. This person knows it this time around. If this is a past person, they know this. If this is someone new, they already know based off of how you carry yourself. This person is taking you on some type of trip. They're going to offer to take you on a trip. They want to get you guys up out of your element. Put you in a better headspace. And then they're going to come in for the kill. And when I say come in for the kill, <laughs> they trying to lock you down. And they know that the only way to do that is through their actions. They're going to have to show you. They're going to have to show you, and they're going to have to express themselves. So, be on the lookout, Collective. You're getting ready to go on a vacation. 